Hey guys, I had an order that I shipped out in the beginning of November and it has been missing and I got a confirmation from the post now that they are not going to find it. So they're giving me a, a refund and I have like contacted the customer and let them know like what is happening and that we will have to find a solution because some of the products that she ordered, I don't have anymore. Like she ordered the last five and for one product, I have four left and she ordered five. So if she wants one in a different color or if she wants all of them in a different color or if she just wants to cancel the entire order, we'll see um, what will happen with that. But I also got another order, so I'm going to be packing up that and shipping it off. I need to film my orders for or my videos for Phony as well. So I'm going to be doing that and um, I have to leave home around 5, no, like 4.30 probably. Mary's is probably going to be home by 3, so I have to finish work by then or I want to finish work by then. And it is now 11.39 and it's probably going to take me a couple of hours to shoot the phony videos, which means that by that point it will be 13.39 and then packing and getting that order to the post office. I'm going to just drive that to the post office when I leave later today. I also got a project from Lionbridge today and that has deadline tomorrow and they never have deadlines on Saturdays. And also the link that they sent for the... the, um, the files that I needed weren't there. Like the link was off and the folder didn't have anything in it. And I generally don't work weekends, but also I'm going out to a cabin this weekend and I have said that I need to do some work. Um, so I have to empty the customer service queue tomorrow. But if I do that in the morning, then it's just still like half an hour of work. It's not really any big deal. Um... But doing that job could also take like an hour or so. And like that at that point, it's just ugh, it's too much. So I like replied and said that the products or the not the price, but the files aren't there. And also like the deadline is tomorrow, Saturday. Um, can we push that to end of business day on Monday? Or are you paying the weekend salary? Weekend rate. I think I said that my rate is 50% higher during on um on weekends but if they can't change the deadline i have to do that today i slept in today as well so that's on me well actually i didn't sleep in like marius woke up at like 5 10 he like said goodbye like we always do in the mornings and i wasn't able to fall back asleep so i just like scrolled on my phone for like an hour and then i fell back asleep and i slept for a while and then i didn't get up until it was like nine o'clock or something Hey guys, I have some work to do and it's so cold in my room. It's 17 degrees in here and I have my heater set to max. So I haven't really been working in here that much. It's the 5th of December today and I still haven't put up our Christmas tree, but I just have some work to do now and then I'm gonna head to Evelyn's and we're gonna be looking at a little cruise to Kiel in Germany, which we have been doing pretty much annually for the last few years. 
but I need to get this work done first because it is to be delivered today. I got feedback on a project that I delivered, which was really nice, and they said that they were really impressed with how it had been and that they would love to work with me on a future project as well, which is really cool. And on Thursday next week, on the 14th, I'm going to Christine's book signing in Oslo. And I'm also going to be re recording another episode of the podcast that I recorded last December. And the episode that I featured in is one of the most seen in the past year, which is awesome. Um, and um, we're going to do like a follow up. Hey guys, I am in my car and I drove a friend to the doctors and I'm just waiting for her to get done. So I'm just working a little bit. I have this like thing that you attach to the steering wheel and it is working pretty well. I even have my seat like leaned back, um, but it's, it seems pretty well. So I just got a project, so I'm going to see if I can get that done. It was like a translation of like, I don't know, 250 words or something like that. So if I can get that done, her appointment starts about now and it's going to be like 20 or 30 minutes. Um, but it's from a new vendor that I haven't been uh, working for before. So that's going to be interesting because the deadline is today at 5 and it's now 10.10. 10, so. Hey guys, I have a meeting in 25 minutes, so I am going to freshen up my face a little bit. I also just changed into a t-shirt and a blazer, just because it looks a little bit more professional than the like blue fuzzy sweater that I had on earlier today. While I was out, I also got a different, I mean, it's technically three jobs which has deadline at five. It's now right past three. And I tried to send a message to my contact person, but she's not responding. And it's the first time I'm working for that company. So I'm like trying to get some clarification so that I can actually like finish the job before five. I don't know what I feel about this color.
Hey guys, it is 11.30, so I'm gonna head to the post. I have two packages that I need to get out before noon because I wanna make sure that they get with the mail today since it's Friday. And then I had a project that had deadline today and it was estimated three to four hours, but it only took me an hour and a half, which was great because that saved me some time I'm going to head to the post office and then take a shower and then I'm going to go or I'm going to film the videos for phony. I have two videos that I'm going to get out and then I like to do those in the chair so I can just do that after I take a shower. I'm also really happy because it's not as cold anymore. We had like minus 20 to minus 25 for a couple of weeks. And now we're back to minus five, which is so much more comfortable. Because you don't freeze to death the second you step outside the door. So I just have my packages here. And uh, Mary's also wanted something at the store. So I'm going to stop by and pick up that for him as well. For lunch, I have the last of my carrot sweet potato soup that I made a few days ago. Um, it's basically just like one big sweet potato, three pretty big carrots, some like veggie bouillon water. I put in one onion and some garlic, salt and pepper, some carrot milk. No, some carrot milk. <laughs> some coconut milk. And I think that's basically it. Like salt and pepper, obviously. It was very, very easy. And now I'm just watering it down with a little bit of unsweetened soy milk. And then I am putting some everything about the bagel seasoning on it, which I tried yesterday and it was amazing. And then I just have some buttered toast. And I'm just gonna find some more coffee. I like oat milk in my coffee. I'm gonna eat my lunch and I'm gonna watch an episode of Superstore and then after that I'm gonna film my two videos for Froni. And by the time I've done that, Mary's is probably almost on his way home, so. I filmed both of the videos for Phony. There was also two videos to be reviewed, so I did those. And I am basically done with work now. I still have... I have to empty the customer service queue once more. I've emptied that once today. Good morning. <clears throat> we have a fire going. Coffee. <clears throat> and my book. So I'm just gonna read and chill a little bit. I haven't read like a physical book since I went to Tenerife and I am halfway in this. So I want to keep going. It is snowing a lot. I'm headed to the grocery store. Not the one that I usually go to, which is close. I'm gonna have to drive. It's like a 10 minute drive. It's not too bad. It's also even warmer today. It's minus like 0.5. It's like around freezing, which is making me happy. Good morning. I'm just trying to make everything function. My computer doesn't want to charge through this thing, which is annoying. So I'm just going to talk to you and then my computer can charge a little bit. I have a little bit of work to do today. I started emptying the customer service queue downstairs, but then my computer went out of battery. Because I put it to charge, I thought, last night, but it didn't want to charge with this thing, so... I don't know what's up with that. I've never had problems with it before. And then I am... I have a quality control thing for Lionbridge that is due today. I'm delivering the test YouTube editing today, which is just like a five minute video. And then I have an order that I need to pack and get out. 
and I have I have to stop go to the store because I bought like a vegan cheese and the vegan cheese is it's moldy and it's unopened and it's like best before like February sometime so I don't know what's up with that so I'm gonna have to figure that out and I'm gonna stop by there and see if they can trade it for a new one I also think I'm gonna get a webcam because my I've just been using my laptop but the angle and stuff is kind of weird so I've been considering getting a webcam that I can just stick on top of my screen I don't really have a lot of meetings but you never know so it would be better to have one and not use it that much than to not have one at all and if i'm getting one i'll just get one of the like cheap ones 